Hey kids, I just wanted to start out with this facing me because I miss your faces and um, I am very excited to start doing this online recording and lessons with you so I hope that um, these videos are helpful and please, 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 if you have any questions, have your parents email me or you email me because some of you know how to use your emails so let's get to it. Okay, so today is Monday, April 6th, or at least it will be, and your assignment today will be Spanish. So here I'm under classwork, I'm under kindergarten right now, but um, this will be going for kindergarten, first, second, and third grade. So if you are in one of those grades, you're at the right video. Um, so here I have classwork. I've come down to your Monday, April 6th assignment for me, Spanish. So you'll see other ones here, but here's mine. So under here, you'll see another link that will actually be to this video. So hopefully you've gotten here. Um, but then below that will be the link to where your work will be done today. So you'll start by clicking the link. Okay. And it takes you to this online free Spanish page. So this will be a good exercise of your internet skills, all of you kiddos, because you see all this stuff around here, you do not want to click on it, okay? You see start, you see these grades, those are all ads. We're gonna scoot past those, okay? Because past the ads, there's some good, some good stuff down here, okay? So the first one of these icons you're gonna click on is pets vocabulario okay so you're gonna click on there and you're gonna scroll down remember not to touch any of this stuff up here exercise that self-control all right she's loading right now las mascotas Las mascotas, good. So the thing I like about this is that it also tells you how to correctly say it. So as you're going through these, you're gonna click on each animal and you're gonna click on their words. So this is a cockatoo and in Spanish it is? La cacatua. La cacatua, okay? So there are one, two, three, three screens of vocabulario, okay? So I want you to go through all of these and as they say the words, el conejo, el conejo I want you to practice Bo, it with it, all right? Me, ho, My favorite animal el gato, is el gato. So, ga, to, el gato. He likes to speak a lot, so. <laughs> It'll, it'll tell you very specifically how to say it. All right, so go through all of these. Cacatua, el gato, etc., etc. Once you're done with that, you're gonna go up here to the back button. Because you wanna go back to that main screen. If you get lost, you can always go back to your main assignment and click on the link again, okay? Um, but the next thing, once you've gone through the vocabulario, um, you want to go all the way down here where it says click and match. Now, if you are not confident in your, your reading abilities, you don't have to do this one. So if you are in kindergarten or first grade and you don't feel comfortable reading it on your own, or if your parents aren't there to help you with it, you don't have to do this part. But if you are in first, second, or third grade and you do feel confident in your reading abilities then you need to do click and match okay so you'll say play and here you start to put in to practice what you just learned so let's see comida, comida, comida. you click and drag so practice your clicking and dragging skills we have conejo, conejo. we know that's a rabbit <coughs> we have a rana, rana. that's a frog we have cacatua, which is a cacatoo. Perico. Perico, which is a parakeet or yeah, parrot. Lagartija. Lagartija. Okay, so you're gonna do that. 
one or two times, depending on how much you want to try and do it. Once you're done with that, remember, don't touch these, go back. So once you've done, so you're going to do this and then this, and then I want you to go to the memory game. Okay. So the memory game is very similar and you can pick how hard you want it to be. There we go. So you can do just three, four, five. I think you should all do at least six, okay? But those of you who are a bit older, I challenge you to do 12. And you're gonna do this memory game. Camaleon, raton. And you can even, here, let's go back. You can even make it show cards at the beginning so you can do it visually as well. And what I would like you to do, so here, look, you can kind of see it. Three, two, one. Oh, you get to memorize it for a while. That's fun. All right. So I saw Gato, which is cat, which is my favorite. Gato. So gato. once you get a match, I want you to say the word again. So say Gato. Good. Um, let's see. Curi. Curi, Curi. is a guinea pig. <laughs> so... Finish that up. You can only you can do this just once if you do the 12. That would be fine. But make sure you're repeating the word after she says it on there, okay? Finally, go back again. Finally, if you are able to print, go to the coloring pages over here. And find your favorite animal, okay? Um, I actually printed out the gato the gato sheet as i said that's my favorite i love cats um so find your favorite coloring sheet this is optional because not everyone may be able to print right away or um whatever but i would like you guys to also do this if you need something extra to do to help with your spanish because then also you can write it out as well besides just knowing the words and how to say them so all right Thank you very much again if you guys have any questions please 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 email me or comment on the google classroom assignment and i will be there to help so thanks guys good luck